configure the digital inputs, which are only available in the MyEbox 1500 model, you have to connect the unit using the MyEbox app and enter the setup menu using the top left menu on the instantaneous parameters screen. When you enter the inputs menu, you can configure its two digital inputs. The parameters to configure are the name of the input, the units that will be recorded by the input and its operating mode. It has three programming modes. In state mode, the unit records the state of the input, which can be open or closed, for example detecting the tripping of a circuit breaker, the opening of an electric panel or detecting a change in a sensor, whether a presence, fire or flood sensor, etc. It can also assign an action each time that this occurs. In tariff mode, the unit can distinguish between two different tariffs for energy values. So if the installation has a system with a dual power source, e.g. mains and generator, the unit will divide the consumption into two different records to distinguish between the price of both energy sources. In meter mode, the unit will count the number of pulses sent by any pulse meter. For example, it is possible to associate the pulse output of a water, gas or heating meter in order to have a record of the different type of consumption in a single unit. The unit enables the programming of the multiplier factor of any meter with a pulse probe. For example, if a water meter has a pulse probe with a conversion rate of 1000 pulses per cubic meter of water, or liters, this will be the value that will be programmed by associating the cubic meter or liter variable with the input's value. In the following example, the input is programmed to detect the state of a door opening relay of the electric panel. The name is configured and state mode is selected. Once the changes have been made, save them using the icon in the top right corner. That is how easy it is to configure the inputs in my e-box.